Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Flo Wealth and I talk all about Canadian immigration from the latest news to updates, tips and everything you need to know to move or settle in Canada, I've got you covered. Today, I've got some exciting news to share and trust me, this is something you don't want to miss especially if you're in Canada on a work permit or you're in the process of applying for permanent residency, PR. There's been a lot of uncertainty lately, especially with the recent cancellation of the visitor visa to work permit policy. But here's the good news. For many of you currently in Canada, there's a new work permit policy that's going to be a game changer. So make sure to stick around to the very end as we dive deep into who this affects, how it works and how you can take advantage of it. Now, let's talk about a situation that's probably familiar to a lot of you out there. Picture this, meet Lara. She's been living in Toronto for the past two years, working as a caregiver, and her work permit is about to expire in just a few weeks. Her permanent residency application is still pending, and she's really stressed about whether she'll hear back in time, or if she'll have to stop working, or even leave Canada. This is a real issue affecting a lot of people, just like Lara, across the country. So, what's the good news? The Canadian government has introduced a new temporary public policy for people like Lara. Under this policy, if your work permit is about to expire or has recently expired, you can still keep working while waiting for your PR application to be processed. This new policy, which came into effect on August 11, 2024, is valid until December 2024, and it's a lifeline for so many caught up in processing delays. Now, Let's break down who exactly can benefit from this policy. There are three main groups. Current work permit holders. If your work permit expires on or before December 31st, 2024, and you've applied for a new one with a support letter from your province, you're eligible. Expired work permit holders. If your work permit expired after May 7th, 2024, and you applied for a new one and restored your status, you're also eligible. Don't forget, you need that support letter from your province or territory. Pending work permit applications. If your work permit extension is still being processed and you applied before May 7, 2024, under paragraph 186U, you're good to go as long as you meet the other criteria. Let's look at another example. Steve is a software developer who's been living in Vancouver for four years. His work permit is about to expire and just like Lara, his PR application is still in process. Thanks to this new policy, Steve doesn't have to worry about losing his job or income. He can continue working while waiting for his PR application to go through. Big relief, right? Some of you might be thinking, wait, Flow Wealth, isn't this just like the bridging open work permit? Well, not exactly. The main difference is, for this new policy, you don't need to have already applied for PR to qualify. All you need is that crucial support letter from your province. Let's talk about that support letter I keep mentioning. It's a critical document you'll need to submit with your application. This letter comes from the provincial authority of the province you're living in, and it confirms that you're in the provincial nominee program, PNP, or its application pool. Without this letter, you won't be able to benefit from the new policy. So what should you do next? Here's a simple step-by-step -step guide. Check your eligibility. Make sure you meet all the criteria. Do you have an expiring work permit? Have you applied for a new one? Do you have that support letter? Gather your documents. Make sure to have your support letter, job offer, and any other required paperwork ready. Submit your application. Apply under Section 200 of the Immigration Regulations. And if your work permit has already expired, make sure to apply for restoration of status. At the end of the day, this new policy is a huge relief for so many people who've been stuck in limbo between expiring work permits and pending PR applications. It gives you a clear path to continue working and contributing to the Canadian economy while waiting for your PR. So if you think you're eligible, don't wait, get your documents together and apply today. And before I go, I know a lot of you are still wondering about the visitor visa to work permit policy that was recently cancelled. I've made a detailed video on that topic, which you can watch here, point to video. If you have any more questions, feel free to drop a comment below or reach out to me directly. My consultation link is in the description. Thanks for watching. And if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. See you in the next one.